Hey yeah, guys, okay guys, so um, so we're gonna do a lesson on the dominant seven chord progressions, okay? So for today, I'm gonna give you the basic of the dominant seven. So you guys gonna practice, okay? And I'm gonna show you a different octave, or you can call it different intervals, okay? So I'm gonna make the lesson uh, a bit simple, a bit simple for you guys to uh, understand, okay? Uh, so let's work it at the key of the key of F. Okay, uh, this is the key of F on the second string there. Play the second string here. So you have your do de la do do mi re. You have your do de la do do mi re. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna start in three step. So the number one we're gonna play here. Okay, that is the dominant seven, dominant seven chord, F dominant seven chord. We have it here also. Okay, and then we have it here. Okay, we have it here. We have it here, and we have it here. Okay, I think these three places are the most uh, major part of uh, the guitar uh, fretboard. Okay, uh, that goes with the same with all the keys on the guitar fretboard. So uh, how you can get your dominant seven is uh, when you add your tall. Okay, that gives you a dominant seven. So in other words, your root, your third. Okay, then your do, then your do again. Okay, gives you a dominant seven. That's do do mi do do mi do. Okay, do mi do give you a dominant seven chord. Okay, okay. So this is your do la so. So if you, before you get your la, you have your do here. Okay, your do. So okay, ba mi re do. Okay, so you hold like this. Take your ring finger. Okay, take your ring finger to uh, the root here. This is your normal chord, your normal F chord. Do so mi do, do mi so do. So this, this is how you're gonna hold your seventh, your dominant chord, dominant seven chord. Okay, you take your ring finger, okay, to the root here yeah, on the fifth string, while your index finger goes to the mid on the fourth string, okay. Then your pinky goes under that, under the do here, yeah. the same fret. That gives you a that, or uh, that will be your top, okay. Do mi do. Then your first finger will hit on the do here on the second string here okay okay that gives you a dominant seven on this other interval so if you come to this other interval this is your do okay remember you have your do chord here in the key of f And have it here so once you remove this your do okay once you remove this your do from the pinky it gives you a dominant that makes the toy here to sound because this is do 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 okay so when you hold your do so do okay it gives you a dominant so you go to this shape now Okay, we have another interval here, yeah, the key of F, this is the key of F. So if you play from your do. Okay, or you can play like this, do re mi fa sol la ti do. So you have your do ti do, do 
just like holding this shape now you can equally hold this other interval like this from your root to so, to, mi. so this one will be do so, to, mi. so you bow with your first finger from the uh, root there you take your ring fingers to the saw on the first string okay while your first finger bow the third there on the third string then your pinky goes on the me okay self fret okay that gives you okay that gives you a dominant seven on this other octave okay so uh this place you just like this place okay just like this okay so you can have it here also just like a hold it so that is a, another octave okay and so on if you're playing with electric so at first this is how you can hold your dominant seventh chord okay so that you can so in my in my next lesson i'm going to show you how you can improvise using them okay thanks for watching and see you in the next video